When we gaze into the night sky, we are not merely observing points of light, but experiencing a tapestry of cosmic narratives. One of these stories belongs to Wolf Rayet, 124, WR 124, a magnificent beacon of intense luminosity and heat located in the vastness of space. As a member of the Wolf Ray A class of stars, WR 124 has unique characteristics that set it apart. These stars are known for their unusually high temperatures that can reach upwards of 50,000 Kelvin, sizes that dwarf our sun, and radiance that outshines even the most luminous supergiants. This amalgamation of high temperatures, vast sizes, and intense luminosity makes them intriguing objects of study, serving as windows into the extraordinary mechanisms at work in the universe. A stellar view from the James Webb Space Telescope. Shifting our gaze from the star itself, let's focus on how it is observed. The James Webb Space Telescope, successor to the Hubble Space Telescope, has captured a remarkable image of WR-124. This image, a composite of near-infrared and mid-infrared wavelengths of light, paints a stunningly detailed portrait of the star and its surrounding nebula. The process of combining different wavelengths of light enables us to observe and appreciate celestial features that might otherwise be hidden. With this advanced capability, the James Webb Space Telescope ushers in a new era of astrophysical exploration, offering unprecedented insights into objects like WR-124. The celestial tapestry gets richer, the star narratives more detailed, and our understanding of the universe continually expands. Decoding the diffraction spikes. As we delve deeper into the exquisite image of WR-124, captured by the James Webb Space Telescope, one feature that commands attention is the set of radiant diffraction spikes that protrude from the star. But what exactly are these spikes? And why are they significant? In essence, diffraction spikes are an optical phenomenon, an artifact of the imaging process. When the light from a star passes through the telescope's optics, particularly its mirror support structure, known as a spider, it bends slightly, a process called diffraction. The result is a striking cross-like pattern, creating the spikes we see emanating from the star. Contrary to initial thought, these spikes are not inherent properties of the star itself, but are caused by the physical structure of the telescope. However, they are more than just visually intriguing. They can also offer indirect information about the telescope's design and the quality of its imaging. In the case of the James Webb Space Telescope, the diffraction spikes from WR-124 are testament to the telescope's finely tuned optical system. They reflect the unique hexagonal design of the telescope's primary mirror, composed of 18 separate segments and the intricacy of its spider structure. Through this, we not only gain deeper insight into the celestial marvel that is WR-124, but also appreciate the terrestrial marvel of the technology that allows us to study it. Balancing Acts in Space, the Role of NIRCAM and MIRI As we further decode the image of WR-124, the contributions of two major tools on the James Webb Space Telescope come into sharp focus. The Near-Infrared Camera, NIRCAM, and the Mid-Infrared Instrument, MIRI. NIRCAM plays a delicate balancing act when capturing images like WR-124. Stars are incredibly bright celestial bodies, and their luminosity can overpower and obscure finer details, especially those of the fainter gas and dust surrounding them. NIRCAM, however, has been carefully calibrated to effectively manage this difference in brightness levels. It ensures that the brilliance of the star is not washed out, yet still captures the elusive details of its surrounding nebula. In a complementary role, MIRI reveals the nebula's intricate structure in the mid-infrared wavelength, bringing out details that NERCAM may not fully cover. The strength of MIRI lies in its ability to observe cold, distant objects and phenomena in the universe, such as the dusty nebula around WR-124. Together, NERCAM and MIRI perform a kind of celestial duet, harmoniously working together to create the richly detailed image of WR-124. Their combined capabilities 
highlight the impressive range of the James Webb Space Telescope and offer a greater understanding of the complexity and beauty that permeate our universe. In this way, the study of WR-124 also illuminates the incredible technological advancements in space observation that bring the cosmos closer to us. The Backdrop of the Universe With the magnificence of WSAR-124 and the capabilities of the James Webb Space Telescope outlined, we now take a step back to appreciate the larger cosmic scene unfolding around the star. The image not only portrays WR-124 and its nebula, but also a grander view of space teeming with other celestial bodies. At a casual glance, the space around WR-124 might seem emptier or less remarkable. However, on closer inspection, we can perceive myriad other points of light speckling the scene. These aren't just random points of brightness, but an ensemble of distant stars and galaxies. Each one of these celestial bodies has its own story and context, contributing to the cosmic drama on a grand scale. They are not just static features in the field of view, but actively interact with the nebula surrounding WR-124. The backdrop stars and galaxies subtly peek through the nebula, interacting with the gas and dust ejected from WUR-124. This dynamic interplay between distant stars and the nebula offers a visually stunning representation of the interconnected nature of celestial objects within our universe. These less obvious aspects of the image invite us to ponder the fascinating dynamics at play in the wider cosmos and reflect on our continually evolving understanding of space. By broadening our perspective, we can begin to appreciate the true enormity and complexity of the universe that surrounds us, enhancing our fascination and respect for the cosmos. A Nebulous Tale Reading the History of WR-124 as we delve further into the intriguing world of WR-124, it's essential to consider the nebula surrounding the star. This vast cloud of gas and dust, flung out from the star itself, is not just a static backdrop but a dynamic diary, chronicling the turbulent history of WR-124. When we think of a nebula, we often picture smooth, symmetric structures. However, the nebula around WR-124 belies this notion. Instead, it's marked by a chaotic display of random, asymmetric ejections. This irregular pattern is not without purpose. It provides a rich archive of the star's past episodes of mass loss. As WR-124 aged, it shed a significant portion of its mass in violent outbursts. These sporadic events ejected material into space, with each significant episode contributing to the nebula we see today. By studying the nebula's structure, Astronomers can gain insights into these dramatic events, and by extension, the life story of WR-124. The nebula around WR-124 serves as a tangible record of the star's turbulent past, offering a wealth of information for scientists. It stands as a testament to the extreme forces at work in massive stars, providing a fascinating window into stellar evolution and the powerful interactions between stars and their environments. In this way, the nebula surrounding WR-124 transforms the star from a mere point of light into a captivating tale of cosmic transformation and intrigue. Nebular Details Tadpoles Swimming in space, one of the most enchanting details found within the nebula surrounding WR-124 are the bright clumps of gas and dust that look like tadpoles swimming in a celestial pond. These oddly shaped structures complete with tails streaming out behind them, add an artistic flair to the scientific image. But they are far more than just cosmic curiosities. They tell a story about the powerful forces at play around WR-124. The tadpoles we see are high-density regions within the nebula, pockets where gas and dust have come together under the influence of gravity and other forces. But why do they look like they're swimming towards the star? And what gives them their tadpole-like shape? The answer lies in the mighty stellar wind blowing from WR-124. These winds, gusting at speeds that dwarf the most powerful hurricanes on Earth, shape the nebula and its contents. When these winds hit the denser regions of the nebula, they are deflected and flow around them, much like water flowing around a stone in a stream. This gives these clumps their tadpole-like appearance, complete with tails, 
that are actually trails of material being blown away from the denser heads. These tadpoles offer intriguing insights into the dynamics at play within the nebula. They shed light on the interactions between the nebula and the stellar wind, revealing how stars like WR-124 can shape their environments even from a distance. By reading these signs, astronomers can piece together more details about the nebula's formation and evolution, adding further depth to our understanding of these amazing celestial objects. WR-124's Cosmic Coordinates A significant aspect of any celestial body is its position in the universe. The celestial coordinates, right ascension, RA, and declination, DEC, are essential to locate any star, galaxy, or nebula in the vast cosmic sea. For Wolf Ray at 124, these coordinates are RA 1911, 30.88, and DEC, plus 16, 51, 38.20. These may appear as mere numbers at first glance, but they provide astronomers with vital information. The right ascension and declination are akin to the longitude and latitude we use on Earth. In celestial terms, right ascension measures the east-west position, akin to longitude, while declination measures the north-south position, akin to latitude. With these coordinates, astronomers can pinpoint the exact location of WR-124 in the sky. Another important characteristic is the star's distance from Earth, which is approximately 15,000 light-years. To understand this distance, consider that light travels nearly 6 trillion miles in one year. This means WR-124 is so far away that the light we see from it today actually started its journey 15,000 years ago. This concept, known as look-back time, reminds us that when we gaze upon the cosmos, we are also looking back in time. Lastly, the star resides in the constellation Sagitta, a small constellation in the northern sky. It's fascinating to understand that the constellation a star resides in, its coordinates, and its distance are all integral parts of its identity and its story. This context not only provides us with a map to locate WR-124, but also gives us a perspective on our place within the cosmic landscape. The Wide View, WR-124 Through Hubble's Eyes While the James Webb Space Telescope provides a breathtaking view of WR-124, this isn't the first time we've peered at this star. Back in 2015, the Hubble Space Telescope, another groundbreaking space observatory, offered us a look at WR-124 through its wide-field planetary camera 2. Hubble's image painted a lively portrait of WR-124, depicting a highly dynamic environment. The star was featured at the very center of the image, a bright beacon amidst an expanse of ejected gas. The clumps of gas, a distinctive feature of this image, appeared to be shot out into space at over 150,000 kilometers per hour, a testament to the violent and energetic processes happening in and around the star. This visual spectacle afforded by Hubble's image was more than just a beautiful sight. It offered crucial insights into the nature of Wolf, Rayet stars. These stars are known for their intense stellar winds, which can result in rapid mass loss and lead to the ejection of large amounts of material into space, seen as the hot gas clumps in the image. Hubble's observations of WR-124 serve as a critical reference point for scientists. By comparing these earlier observations with newer data from the James Webb Space Telescope, astronomers can track changes over time, providing valuable insights into the life cycle and behavior of wolf rayet stars. Thus, the legacy of the Hubble Space Telescope continues to inform and enrich our understanding of the cosmos. Delving into dimensions, understanding the scale of WR-124. The dimensions of WR-124 and its surrounding nebula provide a deeper perspective on this extraordinary celestial system. The image of the star spans about 2.2 arc minutes across, which may seem minuscule on the grand scale of the universe. However, when we translate these angular dimensions into light years, the true scale of WR-124 comes to light, a whopping 10 light years across. This massive spatial extent showcases the extraordinary scale of the structures stars like WR-124 can form. To give this some context, the distance from our Sun to its nearest stellar neighbor, Proxima Centauri, 
is approximately 4.24 light years. This means the nebula surrounding WR124 is more than twice as wide as the distance to the closest star to our own solar system. Furthermore, the gas and dust in this nebula aren't uniformly distributed. Bright clumps of material, shaped by the stellar winds, indicate areas of higher density. By studying these clumps and their distribution, astronomers can gain insights into the forces that shaped the nebula and continue to influence its evolution. In the vastness of space, it can be challenging to grasp the true scale of celestial objects. However, by exploring the dimensions of WR124 and its nebula, we are reminded of the remarkable scales at play in the universe, helping us appreciate the grandeur and complexity of the cosmos in a whole new light. In exploring the cosmic dance of Wolf Rayet 124, we have journeyed through the wonders of the universe, traversing light years of space and millennia of time. We've glimpsed the intriguing beauty of the nebula, dived into the complex interactions of stellar winds and celestial bodies, and seen how our understanding of the cosmos is enhanced by the power of telescopes like Hubble and James Webb. As we stand before the vast expanse of the universe, it's breathtaking to realize how each celestial body, each speck of light in the night sky, holds a tale of cosmic transformation and intrigue. And WR-124, with its captivating nebula and dramatic history, is a testament to the awe-inspiring beauty and complexity that our universe has to offer. If you've enjoyed this journey through the cosmos and are eager for more, remember to like this content and subscribe to our channel. Your support allows us to continue sharing the wonder and grandeur of the universe with you. If you're hungry for another space adventure, be sure to click the video on your screen. There's an infinite universe out there to explore, and we can't wait to journey with you again. Until then, keep looking up and let the stars guide your curiosity.